Good evening. Here we are again. You know I don't need to reintroduce myself because you all know me by now if you're watching this probably. If you're not and you don't know me, I'm Paul. There's myself. <laughs> um, welcome to the channel. Um, today, um, this is Tusha and this is a Christmas beer called Nürburger Christmas Candles Mark Beer. I think Something market, like that. Yeah, market. yeah, Christmas market beer basically. <laughs> And it comes in at 5% ABV. We haven't read anything on it. We've got the Tusha Glass from Glass Man, by the way, on Facebook. He's yeah. doing some good deals on them at the moment. Shush. <laughs> Perfect drafts telling me to pour more. I said no. So, I'm loving the Christmas beers at the moment. Once we've tried we already, have been really good. Yeah, everything, everything's been good, but this is a lot lighter, so. Yeah. They are quite heavy in the um, percentage of the alcohol. Yeah, some of them are doing you right in. <laughs> but I've really enjoyed them. Uh, look at that. Oh, yeah, wow. Good carbonation there. Lovely carbonation. Lovely, deep ton of amber colour, isn't it? Yeah. It's almost got um, a red glow to it. It's like a burnt orange colour. Um, here we go. Here's the bottle. Yep, yeah, we'll do that. And then I'll do a snapshot. Show the glass. There's the drink. And look at the lovely colour of that. It's clear, not hazy. It's got quite good carbonation to begin with, though it's died off a little bit now. Yeah, they do a lot of them, don't mm. they? It's got a nice head on it, hasn't it? Right, yeah. Let's get a shot of these. Right, let's get a shot. Nothing dodgy in the background. I'll keep doing that. Do excuse the background sometimes. <laughs> I'll do but try. Right, so, as I say, it's like a total blind review. Let's turn that round for the camera, get that last little bit in, and then you can have a go on the nose if you like. See what the aromas are. Um, you're picking up some spices there, but this isn't too heavy on aroma. I'm not picking up a lot. Yeah, I'm smelling a lot from that. Smells like that cold or anything. No, no, it smells, it smells more like a, a darker beer, which it is to me. It's got that. With like, the Christmas um, beers that we've tried so far, they've been really, really prominent. Really prominent on the aroma. The taste has been really, really strong. Um, okay. So it smells of Christmas beer. How about yeah. that? There's a little bit of spice in there, maybe a little bit of cinnamon or um, some clove and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's up, but it's there's up. not a strong aroma to this at all. It's an odd bit, but it is a Christmas kind of smell, but it's it's light. Okay, this wasn't like, this isn't like um, the previous Christmas beers we've tasted. This is quite light, easy drinking. Um, oh, it's quite a... Yeah. <laughs> oh, um, okay, oh hold on, the aftertaste. Mm. Um, oh, how do you describe this without... Make the pigs here of it. Um, this reminds me of a, um, a real ale rather than a Christmas type beer. It's kind of, yeah, it is a bit ale ish. It yeah. is. Um, it's quite bitter. It's very bitter, yeah. especially at the end. But not, not that that's a bad thing. And as like Christmas beers go, and it is a like Christmas beer because it's only 5%, I mean, most of them were cocking out or uh, a lot more but it is very bitter at the end it's really strong the hops are 
really. Yeah, it is really. That's all I'm left with. And I'm trying to think of what the first. Uh, it's kind of nice on the mouth, Phil. But then when you swallow it, it's. Um, I mean, we did a Tusha Helly's the other day, didn't we? It was absolutely fantastic. Tusha also do an excellent Pryson, a couple of excellent Pryson, but. Okay, this for me is not hitting all the right notes. You've got a little bit of something that is okay at the beginning, and I'm so trying to pinpoint what it is, but as soon as I taste it, it's gone away, and you're just left with this really bitter aftertaste. It is quite a bitter hot. Yeah. Um, it's a tough one. It's not the best one I've tried. I'm a little bit disappointed, to be fair. You've got no, no cinema. Maybe it's a little bit. Climby. There's no Christmas pudding in it. Yeah. <laughs> it's, um, it's a it, tough one. No, this just for me is very nothingy. You are getting a little bit of taste of maybe some spices or... You know, as you're drinking it, it feels nice. The, the carbonation all, feels almost, nice. And it's Almost a little bit of zest. It's like maybe it's orange zest or something orange like that. Orange maybe. Yeah. A hint of that at the beginning. But it's so slight and it's so overpowered by this bitter taste that just takes over your mouth and then stays on your palate yeah, and the yeah, aftertaste. It's, 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 it's um, tough. I'm really disappointed in this. this. Don't think we're going to be arguing over this no. one after the review. <laughs> uh, unfortunately for me, this is going to be a definite no. Yeah, there is there is no flavour there. With the Christmas beers, I've been getting a lot of warmth, a lot of cinnamon, a lot of fruits. Um, Everything that you kind of think about for Christmas, you're getting it all there. And this just isn't giving me any of that at all. It's not, it's not. I'm really disappointed with it because the other beers yeah. have been really good, but this particular offering isn't for me. It's not rocking the world. No, definitely not. <laughs> it's not, you know, it's um, and a bit of aftertaste. Yeah, and, it, and it, it isn't just bitter, but it lingers. A bit of aftertaste and a fantasy of. Well, Robin Williams, no regrets. And a fantasy of something much better than this. <laughs> oh dear. Um, I hate doing media. this. I hate these reviews. I don't I like I really it. don't like to be this negative about something. Um, but unfortunately, I won't even be drinking the rest of this afterwards. It is not good, in my opinion. It's, it is getting on nerve for me. I've got a couple more as well. Oh. <laughs> Maybe we'll give them out as Christmas presents, people we don't oh. like. <laughs> We've got guests tomorrow. <laughs> Would I? Oh, sound like a Grinch. Would I, as long as they don't watch this before I haven't. Yeah. So we don't upload this before tomorrow night. <laughs> right, um, unfortunately, yeah. Yes and no. I've got to agree. It's, it's not rocking my world either. I'm going to give it as low as mm, probably a two. I think that's probably one of the lowest marks I've given as well. It's one of the lowest ones. It's not that bad. It is. Okay. Well, I'll go on a four, right? Let's not bore anyone anymore. Yep. Um, basically, we do not. There's like this better that much. out there for Christmas beers. Yeah. It's not recommended. <laughs> Unfortunately, I hate doing this, but that's how it goes. Right. Like, subscribe, and comment. Tell me if you like this, if you've had it, anyone. Right. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching. Bonjour, people. Bye.